Hey, what's up everybody? Uh, so today I want to talk about some Marvel. And uh, it's not going to be any Marvel books. It's actually some Marvel news. Kind of some controversy. I don't know if you guys heard about this. Uh, the digital comic change that they're doing on the back of um, your weekly comics. Uh, so pretty much instead of, and this is actually starting in February, instead of uh, having, like, let's say it's Hawkeye number one. And they're actually changing the digital copy. So you don't get a digital copy of Hawkeye number one. You get an assortment of back issues uh, for codes. Um, so starting in February, it's actually going to be a weekly thing. So every week it's going to change. So for this first week, um, it's uh, Civil War 2, issue 0 which was a free comic book day book. So I don't, I don't know. Maybe you should, maybe you should have just gave away issue number one. Uh, Wolverine number 66, which is the first issue of the old man Logan storyline and Captain Marvel number one. Um, so I kind of just stumbled upon this. I really haven't seen anything on Twitter about it. I don't know if I'm following the right people who actually are voicing their opinions on it. Um, I went on Newsarama, uh, they had an article on it, Hollywood Reporter had an article on it, uh, Hollywood Reporter didn't really have any comments, because I really wanted to check the comments, um, and kind of gauge a small reaction of what everyone's thinking, uh, so I went to the Newsarama, and basically the whole comments are just negative, um, and, you know, it's, it's understandable, um, for me, I really don't have, I, I really am not affected by it, but it's just kind of interesting to see what is transpiring. Um, so for me, with the codes, I just love to just give them away. Uh, I never sold them on eBay. I, I just kind of uh, gave them away. I actually gave them away in a video back in the day. Um, I just got a whole bunch of my Marvel books took all the codes down and gave it, uh, just gave it on a video. It's first come, first serve. Um, and also, uh, you know, I was maybe trading codes with my friends, like, hey, here's an issue of this. Trade me a code for an issue of that. So, I mean, that's pretty much my, my dealings with Marvel Digital Codes. Um, so, I mean, people... You know, there's a, from the main comments I got from the Newsarama article, and I'll link the article down below as well, if, um, basically, you know, there's a sort of people that, you know, have their physical copy and take their digital code and put it on their tablet, and they have access to it, um, without having, because, you know, you put your physical copy in a long box and you kind of store it, and sometimes you don't want to dig in the long box and get that certain book, um, you just go to your tablet and you can just read it from there. And it's just kind of the, the, um, accessibility of it, you know? Uh, so I definitely understand that portion. And a lot of the comments I saw were kind of like that. And also that these comics that they're given out, I mean, they're definitely directed to new readers, but for the existing fan base, you know, they've already read that story. They probably already have the issues. They probably have the trade. Um, you know, the Civil War issue zero. If you went to Free Comic Book Day, you probably pick that up. Um, it's just stuff that, and a lot of people are saying it's just not, it's not stuff that I'm interested in, you know. Um, and Marvel is kind of counteracting, you know, saying that these codes are, you know, it, it definitely adds more value to the book. Um, you know, it's paying three ninety nine. So a lot of people were like, why don't you send it? Like, why don't you just make, just take the codes out automatically and just put two ninety nine on it. Just cause basically it's a dollar for that code. If you're, if we're, you know, breaking down the, the, the price of the book, um, and the contents within it. So, um, you know, it's just kind of, it's, I don't know if anyone's, I mean, have you guys, read about the story like what are you what is your reaction i know that someone actually created a petition on i think change.org um i'll link the petition down below too because if you're affected by it and you want to kind of put your name on a petition to stop it you know 
by all means, go ahead. Uh, so, um, you know, there's some upheaval about this, but I don't know if, I mean, it's Marvel. It's, it's not going to change. It's just, you know, we'll let, we'll, um, you know, we'll kind of rage a little bit and then, you know, kind of things will be the way they are. Um, it'll be status quo again. Uh, and we'll just kind of have to deal with it pretty much. Um, but I, I would really like, I kind of wanted to make this video just to kind of see everyone else's reaction to this. I mean, if you want to put in the comments down below or, or stuff like that, I just kind of want to see how this news affects you. Do you use, how do you use your Marvel? How do you use your digital codes for your Marvel books? Do you give them away? Do you put them on your tablet? I kind of want to gauge um, the involvement of the digital codes, uh, I mean, with the YouTube community and kind of see how, how everyone uses their codes. Um, so, so yeah, I mean, you know, it's, it kind of sucks. Um, but I mean, it, de this is definitely created like a promotional thing kind of directed towards new readers and, you know, you know how Marvel is and, you know, they're trying to expand their fan base. So it is what it is. And, um, yeah, I think that's all I really wanted to say on this. Um, if you have any comments or on this, you know, let me know. And, uh, you know, I just wanted to kind of gauge the interest of this story because it's kind of one of those things that I kind of had to search for. Um, and I was kind of surprised Twitter didn't um, pick up on it. I, I don't know if I'm following the right people who are kind of outraged on this, but um, yeah. So thank you guys for watching, um, new video coming soon, whenever. Um, so thank you guys for watching again and I will talk to you guys soon. See you guys later. Peace out.